All right, well, unfortunately our discoveries are not what we had hoped for. There are quite a few unknowns with this Jeep we're trying to get answers to. One of them is we did find a set of Sparta gears in this box over here. So it leads me, leads us to believe that there's some kind of lunchbox locker at least in either the front or rear. So we're We are I guess it's the front. pulling off the cover. We do believe it's probably the front. I think all three of us are in agreement with that. Did you leave a, a bolt in the very top of that? Yes. All right. So we're just working on getting the cover off. We're also going to this box of mystery nuts and bolts right here. We need to find the bolts for the flywheel, the clutch, pressure plate, and the transmission. We're hoping they're in this box. If not, they're in the bottom of the big tote. So that's our goal at the moment is just to answer some questions and then Find all the pieces you need to put it all together. The fluid in this is kind of murky, so it's a good thing that we're taking it apart, regardless. But we are going to now take the cover off and see what the number on the rain gear is. See that? That was a little. Oh, that was filled just about right. All right, well, there's been some water in it. All right, that number there. No, no, on the ring gear, the thing with the teeth on it. Straightforward. Put your finger. Yeah, I'm not seeing a number. Yeah, you might have to spin it around. It should spin because the drive line is just suspended by a strap and there's the front hubs are unlocked. Spin it. You can't free spin it. Well, is that because it was a lot? Oh, I guess. Oh, yeah. You see a number though? Should be the same. Yeah. All right, well, unfortunately our discoveries are not what we had hoped for. There's not a locker front or rear. The uh, spider gears that we found look to be in good shape, but apparently they just decided to replace the spider gears in the rear axle. Um, 
The gearing is 354, which is stock gearing, front and rear. So no reduction gears, no locker. And uh, a couple other bolts and pieces that we gotta go find. We're missing some transmission bolts, we're missing flywheel bolts, we're missing a couple things. Which is to be expected after the thing set, you know, in the drive in the garage for two or three years it, it happens you try to keep bolts and parts and pieces together but inevitably you know they walk away get lost so anyway um i think honestly without putting everything together one at a time there's no way i can tell you we have all of this or we don't have all of that um Mostly it's going to be as we try to put the transmission in We'll find bolts that we're missing and have to go replace, but we do have all of the bolts for the pressure plate so once we get Flywheel bolts, we'll be able to put the pressure plate on it looks like we have most of the bolts for the transmission um, Have to climb up under there look and see but I'm pretty sure we've got all the transmission bolts and probably starter bolts so once we get the, the flywheel bolts we'll be able to get it in we're missing bolts for the top of the transmission to hold the top cover on but we'll go pick those up from the parts store so anyway that's today's update